Alrighty, guys. Hope you're doing good. Let's see here. I gotta wait a few seconds here. Uh, let me pop over to a couple things here and then we'll talk about some storms. Um, hang on, give me a second. Beautiful. Okay. All right, guys. Um, hope you're having a great weekend or had a great weekend, of course. Um, so thunderstorms, we're in severe weather season. And so I've, I've had a lot of questions. People are asking, why are we doing this on YouTube? Okay, so it's uh, simple. <laughs> um, YouTube is a little bit more stable. Facebook, um, you can't really archive the videos. And most importantly, uh, you can monetize YouTube so you can make money. And everybody's about making money. TV stations want to make money. So Nick is on tonight. So he's at uh, the station. He's kind of manning it. If this was a huge situation, I'd be in at work too. But because it's mainly a hail and wind threat, um, I'm kind of streaming from home. He's streaming on KOM's YouTube. So always, so like we have a much bigger event coming in on Tuesday. Um, that's so this is a good night to kind of try to drive people and uh, kind of know where we're going to be doing these. But I want to show you what's going on. So first off, you can see we have a severe thunderstorm watch. This is until four o'clock in the morning. So this is going to be a loud, long night. Our main threat is going to be gusty winds, 60 upwards to 70 with some of these storms, but very large hail. So if your car is parked outside, if you can put it in a garage, you may want to do it because we're going to get some, some of these storms are going to drop some golf ball size hail, which is going to do some damage. I need a new roof actually on my house and uh, I'm going to wait till after severe weather season. I figure why get a new roof now when we're going to get so much severe weather over the next couple months. All right. So severe thunderstorm watch until four o'clock in the morning. You see the yellow box is out in north central northeastern parts of oklahoma that is a severe thunderstorm morning so these storms are really blowing up quickly across the region so look at them from stockton lake lamar pittsburgh columbus uh back through labette county and then a, just a big old cluster out uh, to the west of bartlesville oklahoma so those guys are really going to blow up as we go through the next couple hours. So again, this is mainly, this is a, this is going to be a big hail event, uh, which is not good. So let's go ahead and we're going to zoom in. So this stream, uh, because the storms are blowing up now, um, we'll, pro we'll probably stream it for five or six minutes or something like that. We'll see how these storms go. And then when we start getting a lot of warnings, then I'll put on a stream and we'll just stream until it's done. We'll just kind of hang out. Anybody who wants to hang out through the night. All right, so let's see what's going on right now. You can see the storms from Stockton Lake, north of Stockton, other cells uh, popping up near Lamar. And all these storms right here, these guys have blown up just in the past five or 10 minutes. So you can see how fast they're popping up. So Lamar, back toward Pittsburgh, Columbus, Here's Oswego, so the Joplin Metro, we're dry right now, but I'm looking out the window and I can see some lightning in the distance. So, I live in Webb City, and then we got another little cluster which is getting going across Montgomery County. You can see severe thunderstorm warnings uh, just to the west of Bartlesville. Here's what I loved about COVID, and um, I know everybody learned how to work from home. So I, I hack into our computer systems at work so I can drive the radar right here from home, which is nice. And then I got Nick at work who is doing his thing. Um, but so these storms, they're going to continue to get going over the next couple hours. And they're mainly going to be right along the I-44 corridor and then kind of push south. In fact, let's go through time here. Let's go to the future track. Look at these guys. So here's 1 a.m., so about two hours from now, very, then 